Uh, would you like a cup of tea? All right, do you want a cup of tea? I just thought that was boiled. I'm making tea. Right, we're gonna go, because I'm sick of drinking cups of tea all summer long and we've got nothing else to drink. So we live in the most amazing place. It's not just the sea, but we also live in the amazing countryside and elderflowers are just everywhere at the moment on all the lanes. Every time I go out in the car, I see tons of them. So we've had this amazing idea. Have you made it before? No, have you? No. Yeah, I have. You <laughs> He's made it before. He told me. So uh, we've looked up a little recipe of how you can make elderflowers and now all we have to do is go out and find some elderflowers. Let's go then. Wicker. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> I swear I know how you value these words But I cannot make poetry out of feelings like you do It's probably where you get ticks <laughs> I don't get ticks, what are you on about? <laughs> you just got love you, woman No matter what she <laughs> now I'm holding an empty bottle. So it's raining. Shelter, shelter. I can see loads there, but it's it's in the field. The other side is some barbed wire. <sighs> can you scrump elderflower? Can you scrump it? Yeah. Well, is yeah. that scrumping? It is. I don't think you should uh, go into a farmer's field to get anything really. You should always ask the permission of the landowners, whatever it might be. I recognise this old familiar look. Even when yeah, and this one hasn't got thistles or brambles on it, but it has got stinging nettles. We've struck gold. Elderflower gold. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so these good. are good as well. They're like right, Beautiful. properly flowering. And there's still plenty there to come up as well. With buds, but that's fully in flower, isn't it? Yeah. So we need a whole load of these. Like 30? Yeah. You've left us. Oh, quick, quick. Get out of here. Come on. Have we left? Wait for me. Quick. So, uh, we've got everything we need. In my little red riding hood basket, <laughs> which Tim refuses to carry for some <laughs> reason. I can't work it out why. I wonder. <laughs> I wonder. Uh, I'm just tripping. Don't trip on the road. Right, so, uh, we better get back and make some elderflower cordial. Yeah, because we're getting really thirsty now. We're starting to go downhill fast. Let's uh, let's get back and uh, let's start brewing. Make some cordial. Cool. <laughs>
sitting. Right. Right, first off, we're going to get um, the elderflowers we got earlier, and um, most of the recipes ask for about 30 heads. We're, or um, this sort of recipe is two pints worth. I think we're just going to put in the whole lot. We've got quite a bit here. I don't see that there's a reason as a problem having too many, is there? So I'll just uh, cut a bit of the extra stalky bits off. I don't think this is necessary, but what we're doing is we're heating it and brewing it up, which is a slightly different way. So uh, the less stalk, the better, I guess. We're having to be a little bit improv. Well, yeah, because uh, most of the recipes um, ask you to sort of steep it overnight. So what you would normally do is um, dissolve sugar into water and then you would add the flowers into the sort of hot water and then you would wait for it 24 hours to sort of gently infuse the flavours of the flowers into the liquid that you've just made but we <laughs> well, Lisa can't be bothered to wait 24 hours because she's thirsty so uh, we're just gonna see if this method which essentially should get us from picking to drinking should only take us about about half hour so yeah that's all cut in there so we're going to put in um one and a half pints of water and we'll probably put them in cold it, put the water in cold and then gradually bring it up to slowly sort of simmer it we're trying to speed up the effect of the flavour coming out of the flowers into the water. So rather than waiting for 24 hours, we're going to do it just by, like brewing a cup of tea, basically. That's what we A cup of tea. <laughs> oh God. So we're going to put our uh, pan. We have one and a half litres of cold water and our flowers. Now this recipe also <laughs> asks for some lemon zest. Do we got, have we got a zester? Have we got a grater? No, we, we don't. We live on a boat. I've got a massive chopping board though. We don't have fancy things like lemon zesters. So uh, two lemons. And so it's back to reminiscing with my liquid friend. Good. All right, let's measure, let's measure this in carefully. Right, well, have you got the scales? Um, Measuring jug? Have you got the, uh, what should we use to measure it out precisely? Um, I don't know what, time's running out. Oh my God, that's it. <laughs> uh, this isn't sponsored by Sainsbury's. Lemon juice. <laughs> right, we'll get the heat back on and dissolve the sugar in. Okay. And then uh, Right, just turn just turn the knob all the way around. I know how to switch a gas <laughs> stove. <laughs> That's what you call mansplaining. This is uh, our prepared container, which we have um, sterilised. Sterilised. Do we have? <laughs> yeah, we sterilised. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Once sterilised uh, and cooled, you can keep this in the fridge for a few weeks. Um, what I've done in the past, because <laughs> I've done it loads, um, if you get a plastic bowl and you want to put it in the freezer, don't fill it right to the top, like leave a really good gap because it sort of 
what happens. I don't remember. Do uh, I think it expands and stuff. It's like li only like fill it maybe three quarters or two thirds in a plastic bottle. Um, yeah, in the freezer. And if you put it in the freezer, you can keep it like indefinitely, and it's brilliant that way. That's good. Right, so we're gonna. Um, of course, we've never have done this sort of done. Try to do it in half an hour before, and I just don't know. So um, you can use muslin to do this, or you can use a nice clean tea towel, which is what we've got here. Right, do you want to hold that on our pole? And it is a clean tea towel. Right, and can you? Might have a bit of care. Have a look. So. I'm not articulate like you. I swear I know how you value these words But I cannot make poetry out of feelings like you do Looks <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything <laughs> Sterilised bottle. Ooh. It's cordial, you're supposed to mix it down with water. Yeah, I know, but I think we I think it's worked. <laughs> well let's uh, let's, <laughs> let's try it out. <laughs> Here's your lovely refreshing drink. Ah. Do we not have glasses? Best <laughs> I can do, I'm afraid. That's pretty good. That's yeah. pretty good. Mm. That's pretty good. Oh. It's quite sweet. I'm quite surprised. <laughs> 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 Cheers. Cheers. The best is always.